Welcome to Bilingual Culture Talk with Jeffrey and Miki. Jeffrey and Miki の Bilingual Culture Talk へようこそ。You're watching the Tuesday English Upgrade, made to help you become a better English speaker. 火曜日の English Upgrade では、より良い英語が話せるようになるためのコツなどをお送りします。For the English Upgrade,、mm. uh, let's talk about a question、はい、you can ask. Someone you haven't spoken to in a while. はい、あでは、イングリッシュアップグレードなんですが、あのー、そうですね、久しぶりに会う友達に話しかける言葉をぜひ練習してみましょう。Yeah, so in Japanese, I'm sure you use this a lot.、Mm-hmm. Um, 最近何してる、うん right? 日本語でもたくさん使うと思うんですが、まあ、最近何してる何してたとかそんな感じですね。Right, yeah. And especially now,、うん uh, because of the coronavirus, a lot of people are at home、うん、and a lot of people are contacting old friends and whatnot to see how they've been doing, right?、うん、そうですね。もうこのコロナのことが始まってから、まあ、久しぶりにこうねあの世界にいる友達とこうちょっとコンタクト取ってみようかなっていう人もたくさんいるかなと思います。Yeah, so、uh, a question you can ask a friend、mm-hmm. who lives abroad if you have one is what are you doing these days? はい、あのこれですねこのフレーズ、yeah. ぜひ使ってみてください。So let's go one more time、はい、slowly together.、Mm-hmm. What are you doing these days? What are you doing these days? Yes. What are you doing these days? 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 And when you answer,、mm. just simply say what you're doing. Like, yeah, like. What are you doing these days?、うん、I'm watching Netflix, I'm relaxing,、うん、I'm playing Animal Crossing,、うん、something like that. こんな感じで、はい、答えていただければと思います。で、この,あの質問は現在進行形で聞いてるので、返事も現在進行形でいいんだよね。Yeah, and that's fine. And、うん、if you want, you can use、um, anything else like、うん、完了形、things like that. あの現在形で聞かれても、完了形で答えてもいい。Yes. Okay. Yes. So, if you want to use that、うん、version, that is, what have you been doing? What have you been doing these days?、はい、yes. Yes. 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 What have you been doing these days? Yeah. And these days you could use lately、うん、as well. These days の代わりに lately を使ってもいいです。Yes. 同じような意味ですね。Yeah. Yeah. And、uh, if you say it fast、うん、at a native pace,、うん、what have becomes what of. はい。で、これをネイティブスピードで言うと、what have がくっついて、what of. Yeah. What of. What if? <laughs> what if? What if? <laughs> so make sure you get that V sound. That sounds really natural.、うん、v をこう意識して出してもらうとすごく自然に聞こえますね。Yeah. What have you been doing these days? What have you been doing? <laughs> 難しい。<laughs> what have you been doing lately? <laughs> One more. What have you been doing lately? はい。これです。練習してみてください。<laughs> <laughs> All right, let's, let's check.、Uh, let's try it together. Okay. So, hey, Miki. Hi, Jeff. What are you doing these days?、Um, I'm watching Netflix shows and、uh, I'm playing Animal Crossing. Nice. Yeah, nice. what about you? Well, I'm reading a lot of books、mm. and、uh, I'm studying programming. Mmm, programming. Wow,、yeah. interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, very interesting. Hi. So, <laughs> what are you doing, everyone? Hi, みなさん、何してますか Yeah, or what have you been doing since the coronavirus situation、mm. started? Hi, Corona no, eh, to Corona が始まってから何をしてますかとかですね Right, yeah.、Mm. So, Give us your answer in the comments. Hi. And、uh, we'll be looking forward to reading those.、うん
、ぜひコメントで教えてください。あ、それは言わなくていいのかなあの、この、How, What are you doing と What have you been doing のニュアンスの違い。Okay, yeah, let's explain that a little bit.、うん、少しだけ気になる人もいると思うので。Right, so what are you doing these、うん、days and what have you been doing these days?、うん um, for the more advanced people、うん、out there, we can explain the differences. Right. In Japanese, you don't have the present perfect tense or the perfect tense. So, kanjo ke wa nihongo ni wa arimasen. Nai ne. Yes. But in English, there is a clear difference.、Mm-hmm. Um, sometimes it's not always <laughs> easy to see. Kanjo ke wa keko ko ego no nuance teki ni wa ma chigai ga arun desu ga, ma toki toki sore ga wakari ni kui toki mo arimas. Yeah. Um, but the main difference here,、mm. so what are you doing、mm. these days? And what have you been doing these、mm. days? If I give you two examples, I'm studying English.、Mm-hmm. I've been studying English. Hi, これ2つの例なんですが、どっちも英語を勉強してますっていう文章ですね。Yes,、mm. I've been studying English. I have been studying English.、Mm-hmm. Or I am studying English. Hi. 現在形と現在完了進行形。どっちも、yes. はい、yes. 英語を勉強してますっていうふうに日本語ではなります。Right. But for、um, 現在完了進行形、mm-hmm. that is、um, the nuance is that it started sometime in the past、mm-hmm. and it's still continuing today. はい。この現在完了進行形のイメージとしては過去のある地点から始まって今も続いているっていうこの期間がすごくあの焦点を当てられているかなと思います。Right. But for ING 進行形になると、うんうん uh, It's just what you're doing now, right?、うん、so I'm studying English.、うん、it doesn't have the nuance that you started in the past and you're still doing it today. It's just that you're doing it, right?、うん現在進行形だと、まあ、本当に今何してるかっていうところを現在にしか焦点は当たっていないので、別に過去のある地点から始めたっていうところまではあの入ってないかなという感じです。Right, but、うん、I've been studying English. The nuance is that you've started sometime in the past、うん、and you're continuing today. そうですね。完了,形な完了進行形になると、本当にある地点からずっと頑張って勉強してますっていうイメージが強くなるかなと思います。Yeah, so for example, if you started studying English yesterday, you wouldn't say, <笑> I've been studying English for a day. <笑>そうですね。例えば、yeah. 昨日英語の勉強を始めたときは、この現在完了進行形っていうのは使わないです。Mm-hmm. But、uh, time is a tricky thing.、Mm. So, some things where time, the time period is shorter, like,、mm. like for example, fasting.、Mm, fasting, とかそういう fasting, 断食ですね、yeah. そういうものだと結構み期間が短いので。Right, so you could say, I've been fasting、mm. for a day, or I've been fasting for two days. なるほど。そういう時は、現在完了進行形を使うことができます。なるほど。あの、そうですね。難しい。確かに。<笑> yes. でもまあまあ、イメージとしてはこの、なんか期間の軸が見えるか、もう、それを見せずに、ただ今やってることを言いたいかっていうところかな。Exactly. Yes. Yes. That's right. And for those of you studying Japanese, just know that there is no kanjoke. It's just,、uh, it really depends on the context, I guess. うそうなんです。日本語には本当にないので、これはもう英語の文章の中で、内容の中でこう慣れていくしかないかなと思います。Yeah. So, enough of the deep grammar explanation. <laughs> To join the bilingual conversation, subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on those notifications. みなさんとぜひ交流していきたいので、チャンネル登録をして通知ボタンをオンにしてください